Hey guys, I'm Andrew Freeman. I'm George Frangidakis. I'm Mikey Cook. And today we're gonna to be casting our silicone mask. Immortal style, yeah. So we're gonna go over several different things, including general mold prep. It's important to give the material enough time to do its thing before moving forward on the next step because it could potentially cause some issues. We're gonna talk about all the materials that we use. We're gonna be seating the fully power meshed core into the negative bolting everything together, kind of go over some of the tints, and we're gonna talk about pouring the material and, and filling the mold and demolding it. At the end of the day, we're gonna have a mask ready. Each aspect of casting and making a silicone mask should be respected, and if you respect and understand each department and pursuit, then everything works pretty smoothly once you get it. But for the most part, uh, it's some of these little things that we're kind of going over here today to help you guys avoid any problems You know, when you're making your silicone mask. This can be intimidating to some people. Don't worry about it. We're here to ease you into it and teach you how to do it the right way. I guess there's no right or wrong way as long as it doesn't come out wrong, you know. So there's a lot of things to cover and uh, it's going to be a busy day so let's get going.